We'll guide you through how to do a speed ramp in DaVinci Resolve. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, in DaVinci Resolve, make sure edit is selected in the bottom. Add the clip which you wish to go in speed ramp. And then what you need to do is just go and select it, right click it, and go and click on retime controls, just like so. Now we need to choose the point where you wish to go and start the speed ramp. So for example, I wish to go and start it here. And then what you need to do is go and click on where it's 100% as an arrow and click on add speed point and it will add the point there. And then you want to go and choose where you wish to go and stop the speed ramp. For example, here, I'll go and stop it. And then you click on the arrow again and click on add speed point again. Now we've gone and separated sort of the different uh, points here. And so then what we can do is go and increase this middle point. We want it to be faster. So I'll go and click on this on the downwards arrow click on change speed and then go and choose the speed. For example, here I'll click on 400%. And then what I can do is go and play it back. As you can see, it suddenly gets quicker there and then it will go slow again. In fact, you can make that even faster if you wish as well. You can also change the speed of the section before and after as well. For example, I'll go and set them down to 50%. If you wish to make your speed more than 800%, then hold control and then click on the points at the top just here, and you can then drag along and make it even faster. And now when we play it back, you're gonna notice it's quite abrupt. It suddenly gets really fast and then it slows down again. So what we can do is really make a proper ramp here. To go and do that, all you need to do is go and right click on it again and you need to go and click on retime curve, just like so, and we can go and see this curve here. Go to the top left of this section and click on this arrow, and we've got these two options selected down here, retime frame and speed. You want to unselect frame and make sure speed is still selected like so. You go and see this graph here, and what you want to do is go and select this first point, and then instead of this straight line, you wanna go for this one here, click there. You can do the same with the other point, click on it and then go and click on this option here to the left. And then what we can do is, as you can see, it's now a bit, bit more of a ramp, but you can go and make this more gradual. So go and select the point. And then when you select it, you get these uh, points either side. You can click and then drag on them just like so. And as you can see, you can make it much more smoother. And then what you can do is do the same for the other side, click on that little dot, and then you can go and drag this to go and make it even smoother, just like so. It's important to note here as well, I'm limited with how much I can ramp this because it's only a short clip here, but if it was longer, then I could go do more of a ramp. But yeah, it's that simple guys. And then what you can do is go and continue editing your video. If you found this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video.